as you can tell, I was just eating breakfast, <laughs> even though it's like about to be four o'clock. It's nuts. Um, I got really into doing my work this morning and I stopped by Starbucks on my way, but I am heading to Trader Joe's. Um, the closest one is like 30 minutes away from me in New Jersey. And if not, I'll be going into New York and nobody's trying to do that. So I'm on my way to Trader Joe's. Um, I'm pulling up in about a minute, so I decided let me take y'all along with me. I will uh, show you guys what I end up getting in like a mini Trader Joe's grocery store haul. Um, if you like videos like this or other wellness content, please give this video a thumbs up, like, subscribe to my channel for more videos and comment down below some other suggestions that you have that you would like to see from me um and yeah we are here is there parking aha uh -huh. i thought so one of the reusable bags has whole foods on it oopsie <laughs> all right let's go inside Thank you. So I got my stuff in the seat next to me, little passenger princess. Um, and I'm on my way home. So when I get home, I will um, show y'all what I got. I spent $180. So I did spend over budget. But to be honest, this isn't just like a like enough stuff for one week. Like there are things that'll probably last me two weeks. So. All right, guys. Um, here in my kitchen, I want to show you what I got. The first thing is that Monstera plant and I got this bouquet of flowers, seasonal flowers. So pretty. And then I have these two bags full of groceries. So let's get into it. First I got these chicken tikka samosas. Um, I got a lot of frozen foods because I know I can just snack on these. I've been dying to try these. I think I'm going to eat these tonight. It's the steamed soup chicken dumplings or chicken soup dumplings. Put that to the side because that's going to get eaten soon. Um, I got this beef bulgogi thinly sliced marinated beef. Um, and does it come with the rice too? Or is it just the beef? And it's a lot. It's like three serving sizes of it. Let me push it out. Yeah, so it's all the beef bulgogi. Um, and I just need to, need to add rice and whatever else I want on the side. But I got some of this. I got some chicken cilantro mini wontons. I got some ube ice cream. some Thai shrimp gyoza. I tried the Thai vegetable ones. Those are really good too. I got some Thai wheat noodles. I have some tofu in my fridge and I figure I can make some quick ramen and I love these like wheat noodles. So yeah, I think these will be yum. And they even come with the recipe on the back. I got some everything bagels because this week I want to make um, a pesto mozzarella egg sandwich for breakfast. So there's enough for me to eat it six times. Um, I got some fresh Atlantic salmon, boneless filet. I got some ground turkey. Bless you, 93% lean, 7% fat. I got a um, beef New York strip steak. 
I got some dairy-free mozzarella style cheese uh, thread, cheese shreds and some shredded Parmesan cheese dairy-free. Um, and then I just got regular, then I got some regular crumble feta cheese. I'm trying to limit my dairy intake. I'm not completely dairy-free. So I wanted to try these like um, as I slowly get into it. I know like grating your own cheese is better too. And I've seen some recipes of how people are making their own cheese. So I might try that, but for now, this is what I'm gonna do. I got two lemons, some blueberries, eggs. These are so good if you've not tried them. The sour cream and onion rings, they're lentil and rice snacks and gluten free. I will literally like eat these in a day. They're so, so good. Um, I just got some coconut water, which let's drink this now. Yeah, needed that. Um, I also got five kombucha one for each day of my work week. I got the pink lady apple. I try, I'm try. i trying this agua de, de kefir, kefir. It's a guava paloma. Really excited to try that. I heard kefir, is it kefir or kefir? I heard that's pretty good along with kombucha. I got my Synergy Trilogy. This is always a good buy. Um, I got the gingerade, that one's really good. And then of this brand, this passion fruit and tangerine is really, really good too. So I got those. Some beef broth, organic beef broth. I got three potatoes to make mashed potatoes. I got some creamy almond butter. I love almond butter. I got the unsalted, so let's see how that is. Um, I got some blue agave syrup. I got some cashews so that I can make some cashew cream. Um, it's really good as a dairy-free alternative to Alfredo sauce. I got two cans of, one is coconut cream and reduced fat coconut milk. I got some non-dairy oat beverage, oat milk. And then I got these seasonings. I'm trying the Green Goddess seasoning blend, the ranch seasoning blend, and organic ground cumin. I also got some old-fashioned organic oats. I think I'm going to pair this with some coconut milk. I think that'll taste really good. And I think that's everything. Oh, and some pesto, some basil pesto, Trader Joe's brand. Eventually, I'll try to make my own, but I really like pesto. This is going to go on my breakfast sandwiches, so I wanted to get that. And I also, oh yeah, I got some golden kiwi. There's five or six in here. One, two, three, four, five. There's five in here. And, oh, I can't forget this. For my little sweet treat pastry this week, I got some vegan banana bread with walnuts. So yeah, that is my Trader Joe's haul. I still need to get some little things from my local grocery store. Um, so that, uh, I can make the meals I want to for the week, but some of these things I'm not gonna go through all this week. And I might not have to go major grocery shopping for two weeks. I also got plants and flowers and stuff, so that's cool. I also got this big juicy seeded watermelon um, from my friend Lala and her husband Peter. And if you're in the Jersey area, they're the Rolled On fam on Instagram and they sell seeded watermelon i don't know how much longer they are going to because of the season but i got one at least one that i can munch on during the week so yeah 
I'm happy with what I got. It was a little much, but again, some of these things are gonna last me more than this week, so I think it's a win. Let me know if you like videos like this, and I'll be sure to keep up with these Trader Joe hauls. I'll at least go to Trader Joe's maybe once a month, if not twice a month. So, yeah. I love you guys. I'll catch you in the next video, which is gonna be me showing you guys um, me refreshing these braids. So, <laughs> until the next one, be blessed, stay safe, and enjoy the motherfucking journey. Peace. All right, so I'm gonna put the soy sauce on top. Oh, I'm so excited. It smells really good. You just pop it in the microwave. I did it for about two and a half minutes because my microwave is a little smaller. And I'm putting two packs of soy sauce. Y'all can see. It's a little salty and I'm sure the soy sauce doesn't help, but the flavor is good. Like, mm, the soup dumplings. And next time I'm gonna have to get the chili crunch oil. Yeah, these will be a part of my shopping haul. So long as they have them. I really should learn how to make it myself fresh, but Mm. Take a bite. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> Bye, y'all.